What you're looking at is a 1 million gallon a day activated sludge wastewater treatment plant utilizing an oxidation ditch, or more commonly referred to as a racetrack. On the far left hand side of this scene, you can see the influent and the return activated sludge that is mixed together and coming into the racetrack. And as the water flows through this unit, the raw influent wastewater comes into contact with bacteria that are cultivated and are set to remove the pollutants that come into the wastewater, such as ammonia, biological oxygen demand, total suspended solids, and phosphorus. Now, as the water proceeds through this racetrack, it will encounter various microorganisms that are designed to remove these pollutants. It will also encounter these mechanical aerators. These aerators are set to provide the oxygen that the aerobic bacteria needs to thrive. Just like you and I, they have to have a respiration or an ability to breathe in order to consume the pollutants that are in the wastewater. Uh, additionally, these are mechanical aerators, therefore there are maintenance that is required and the operations and maintenance manual will provide the specifics that need to be done to keep these operational. These mechanical aerators are floating, so they are able to rise and fall with the level of water that is being treated. This is a shot of a mechanical aerator that is offline, so it's a good opportunity to see what the paddles look like and how they're offset and as they turn, they create the oxygen level in the wastewater stream up to around four milligrams per liter of dissolved oxygen. Once the wastewater has been treated in this unit for approximately 30 minutes to an hour, it is removed via the pumping systems and sent to the next stage of treatment process, which is the clarifiers. The oxidation ditch is a proven technology. It is well established, it is used in many locations, and it is a very efficient way to remove the pollutants associated with raw wastewater and return clean effluent to the receiving streams.